Hello all, welcome to another video and today's video is going to be a day in the life video. So it's Friday, currently filming. Um, I'm in my van as you can see. So I've got to go to work and then later I'm going to be heading up the mid Wales to land dead noise for the Heart of Wales Festival because I am going to be photographing a boxing event Saturday night. So I've got to get the van ready. A few bits got to come out. As you can see the van isn't ready so I'm going to be sleeping on an air bed. I'm going to head up the North Wales and hopefully get a few locations done before I go to the event. So hopefully I get two or three videos out to this weekend. So come and join me as I get the van ready and then tonight I'll be heading to North Wales and then I'll be recording more of the boxing event and showing you guys how I go about it. So this is a first for me, I've never slept in here without the bed because some of you will remember there was a double bed going across here, but I've got different plans that I want to put a kitchen and stuff in it. And I stripped it because it wouldn't sound dead and insulated, but it'll do for the weekend. It'll do, she's all pumped up. I just got to sort out a few other bits now. Right, so it's a good few hours later. It is 20 to eight at night. I've just finished work. I'm in Tesco, well, I was in Tesco's just getting some snacks. Um, it is absolutely hammering down in South Wales, so my sleep up for a night is about an hour and 15 minutes away. So, let's hope it's a bit nicer than it is you. See you in a bit. It is 20 to 10 at night, and I've just got up my park up, and wait until you see this one. I've stopped at you many times, but I've never slept overnight. There aren't any signs to say that we can't. So that's a really good thing. I've just got to set up the van. I'm going to wait and see if this car goes so I can go right and see a good proper view. But wait until you see this now. This is the stopover tonight. Absolutely stunning. And I thought, why not? Absolutely gorgeous up here. It doesn't even look like it rained, to be honest. If it has, it's dried really quick. So as you can see, the van is all set up. So it's not the greatest, but it'll do. I've obviously got to get curtains for this side. You've seen this plenty of times before. And I've got some old thermal lining to block that one out. Um, I'm currently just chilling. I went live with you guys, as you saw. I've been on TikTok. I'm just going to watch some YouTube now. I've got an alarm set for whenever sun rises in the morning. So if it's four o'clock, I've gone for 3.30. Um, I'm then going to be heading up the North Wales, but you won't see that because you'll see that in another video. And I think that's just going to be it for the night. I'm just going to have some food, watch some YouTube because there is 11 o'clock and then I'm going to go to sleep for the night. Right, so I've been in the park up for a while and you can't really see anything. I'll just move the light. As you can see, I'm set up. Hang on, put the adjuster up. It's back to the dodgy ways of uh, camping and I'm just on live with you guys. Shouts out to everybody. Uh, just chilling in the van really. Got here at about um, 20 to 10 I want to say. It's probably close to like 11 o'clock now. Lee Fisher has just put some thumbs. Shouts out to him. And yeah, I just got the alarm set for four in the morning for sunrise and we'll see how it goes. See you all in the morning now. Right, so it's five o'clock in the morning and um, I didn't have a bad night's sleep to be honest. Um, I've just been outside as well. It doesn't seem like it's been raining all that bad because I went out without any shoes on. And the ground is dry um i'm gonna get dressed now i'm gonna move my van a bit and hopefully it'll be a nice day because it's not predicted to be it's predicted thunderstorms later apparently so with a bit of luck we don't get that but now it's just time to uh, uh, clean up the van uh wait for sun sunrise which is 
5 a.m. I wish I, I hope I am said sunset, but yeah, 5 a.m. for sunrise, and then it's time to hit the road to North Wales. I shouldn't have even opened my mouth. It sounds like it's absolutely hammering down now. So sunrise, uh, it's probably going to be out of question. I might still get dressed and head out there, but as for getting anything decent, I don't think that's going to happen. Hopefully it'll be nice up North Wales, but I ain't holding my breath and this is uh, British summertime apparently. Oh. Well, as you can see, sunrise won't be happening, but there's, there's three campers over there, there's one there, and then there was one there, but um, I actually forgot my bloody coat this hour because I had to remember so much stuff. Hopefully it calms down, but I can't see it. And this is apparently British summertime. So I just stopped by for a little break to stretch my legs. I'm heading back down to Mid Wales now. I'm in a place called Maddox. Now over the years, I've passed this place so many times I wouldn't want to count. But behind me, see those? So that is a power station. And I believe that was on abandoned engineering or another show that um, shows some abandoned places. I brought the trusty uh, film camera just to get some shots. There's a fisherman there somewhere, so I'm half tempted to go get my camera really quick. Get the lo zoom lens on and get some photos. I know it's windy, I'm sorry. I haven't got my real camera. and just stopping for, like I said, five or 10 minutes. Um, I think the festival should be about an hour away now so i just can't wait to stop driving because it's going to be nearly six hours today of driving so crazy when you think about it so about half hour ago i arrived at the festival of wales um well festival obviously uh the boxing doesn't start till six it's just gone four o'clock so i'm just gonna chill for a bit and i did six hour six hours 52 minutes of driving today um i don't think i'm going to be staying here i may stay at that viaduct that i stayed in that you'll see coming up on a future video but looking forward to photographing tonight's event this isn't my first one i've done a few it's my first one here though so a bit nervous the ring looks a lot smaller i don't know the rules about boxing i just like photographing it but yeah see you in a bit So, guys, that was a day in a working life for me. Sorry I didn't vlog much of the actual works job because those boxing events, they're so full on and, um, you know, you miss an opportunity to get a cracking photo and you're just going to be gutted about it. As you can see now, I'm in the van. I'm ready to get to sleep. I've been up since four o'clock in the morning, but I'm so stoked because I've got like four videos it's been an epic day if you did like this work style of type of vlog let me know down below if you are new to the channel for van life adventures just following me and my journey through life visiting cool unique places that you may be able to visit yourself kipping in the van and for all our good stuff uh consider subscribing if everybody could smash the like button leave a comment down below and i'll see you all in the next video thank you all so much for the support and peace.